Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This is the Fools News on today on thirtieth January newspaper front page on Pakistan reaffirms opposition to nuclear ban treaty. None of the nine nuclear weapon states have signed the agreement by Bakir Sajjad Sayyid. Islamabad, Pakistan on a Friday reiterated its opposition to the Muk Ban Treaty and emphasized that it was not bound by any of its provisions. The Treaty on Prohibition of Nuclear Weapons which was adopted in July 2017, was negotiated outside the established United Nations Disarmament Negotiating Forums, the Foreign Office said, while elaborating Pakistan's position on the treaty that took effect from January 22, 2021. The treaty was the result of efforts of the international campaign to abolish nuclear weapons, ICAN, that suppressed the catastrophic humanitarian and environmental consequences of the nukes. None of the nine nuclear weapons states have signed in the treaty that bars signatories from developing, testing, producing, manufacturing, acquiring, possessing, or stockpiling of nuclear weapons on other nuclear explosive devices or other nuclear explosive devices. The parties to the treaty are further disallowed into transfer or accept nuclear weapons and threaten their use. The Foreign Office said none of the nuclear armed countries that took part in the negotiations of the treaty we failed to uh, take on board the legitimate interests of all stakeholders. Many non-nuclear armed states have also reaffirmed from becoming a part of the treaty, it added. 86 countries have signed the treaty, whereas the 52 have ratified it so far. The Foreign Office recalled that the United Nations General Assembly in its session on nuclear disarmament in 1978 had agreed by consensus that the right of each country and to security should be kept in mind while adopting disarm armament measures. The UNGA and had agreed that the objective of disarmament would be uh, undiminished security for all states at the lowest possible level of armaments and military forces. Pakistan believes that this uh, cardinal objective can only be achieved as a cooperative and universal agreed universally agreed undertaking through a consensus-based process involving all relevant uh, stakeholders of which it is serves in equal and undiminished security of all states, the FO said. It is indispensable for any initiative on a nuclear disarmament to take into account the vital security considerations of each and every state it ended. The Apple said that Pakistan did not consider itself bound, bound by any of the obligations enshrined in the treaty. Pakistan suggests that this treaty neither forms a part of nor contributes to the development of customary international law in any manner, it said. 
ICAN says the treaty fills a significant gap in international law. And in the end, the uh, formal request, if you have not yet, please subscribe to the channel and press the like and bell button to get the fresh from us. Thank you for watching. Have a nice time and goodbye.